Hey there, welcome to another episode of Encouraging Word. My name's Dave and I am in wonderful Killarney, Manitoba. It's actually, I believe, above zero today here, which is great. It's fantastic, especially if, if you have to take your puppy out every couple hours. It's fantastic to have nice weather. Uh, trust that you're having a great day. And um, so glad that you've taken time to watch and join in with Encouraging Word. This is just meant to be a brief word of encouragement from the Bible. This week we're taking a little twist on things, and we are talking and trying to share some ideas on how we can be the church. And the number one thing about being the church is we need to connect with one another. Um, uh, we are very individualistic. We, we, it's easy for us to separate ourselves. And, um, you know, when church is normal, we come together on Sunday mornings, but sometimes, sadly, we don't see much of one another during the week. And now that we can't come to church on Sundays, uh, how do we connect with one another? And so it takes effort. And so I've been trying to share a little bit with you simple ways, some non-technological ways, things like phoning and uh, things like that. Uh, yesterday we talked about um, sharing something on Facebook, maybe a, a, a video, a song video or or something like that. I talked about the possibility of a book club, getting together three or four or five friends just to meet uh, each week and share a Bible chapter or something like that. Today I want to go just a little bit more into the technology aspect and remind you that technology is there for us to use and it's really good at connecting people. It's not perfect, but it's it, it, it can be useful. Many of you over the years have used FaceTime or messenger or some other way in which you can connect with your family, see their faces on camera, uh, hear them. It's more than just a telephone call, but you can actually see people. Um, sadly, we in the church, uh, we do that personally, but we often, for whatever reason, don't connect technology to the church. And um, what I would suggest is that you could use the same technology, FaceTime, Messenger, whatever you use to connect with your family, to connect with somebody in the church, just to talk to them. If you have a friend in church you haven't seen for a while, just connect with them, talk to them. Some of you are probably doing that already, I'm assuming, but uh, something that, that could be done. Something we would like to do uh, either later this week, probably early next week, is have an online prayer meeting. We can't have prayer meetings right now, but that doesn't mean we can't get together and pray. We just have to do it online. And with a camera and with a microphone, we can easily do that online and share prayer requests. And so we're going to do that. encourage you to uh, let us know what your prayer requests are so that we can talk about them. Uh, and tonight, we're going to try and do another online communion service. Uh, we're going to do it right here in Facebook. Uh, we have set up a Facebook room and uh, a room is just a place where people can gather and you can turn your camera on and you can uh, use your microphone and talk and see one another. We're going to have communion today, uh, tonight around 7.30 and the room is already uh, uh, made up. Uh, you'll have to join it and uh, turn your camera on. If you have uh, headphones, that's great for reducing some of the sound feedback. But uh, we're going to have communion. It won't be long. Uh, but also, we'll just take a few moments to pray for people. And if you have prayer requests, you'd like us to pray for something specifically, you want to message me that, that'd be great. We'll do that tonight. But we're just going to spend a few minutes of time using some technology to connect with one another. And I know it's not the best. I know it's not the greatest. But we do need to recognize our need to um, support and encourage one another and uh, to greet one another. And uh, it doesn't have to be, you know, real fancy, real technical. It may just be a matter of saying hi, um, just to greet one another and encourage one another. You know, we're so used to shaking hands in church, uh, hugging, as one person reminded, it does tell us to kiss one another, greet one another with a kiss. We're not talking about that. We're not recommending that. Uh, but we can we can just connect online with some technology, make it really simple. Uh, this is great for people who really don't like a lot of human contact. You know, one had once had a lady in our church that 
Uh, I didn't know this, but she didn't like shaking hands. I didn't know that at all. But uh, and she wasn't a, an older lady, she was a younger lady. She just didn't like shaking hands. And she said, I hate this about our church. Well, people like that would do really well with church right now because there's no shaking of hands. You don't have to hug anybody. You don't even have to uh, uh, come up close to anybody. You can wave at them uh, via online and uh and connect that way. We're just going to be doing that. We're going to do it tonight, 7.30 for online um, communion service. But use the technology that's available to uh, connect with people because really church is about connecting with people. Uh, and we want to do that. So let me pray for you, Father God. Thanks so much for this opportunity to uh, come together, this opportunity to share, this opportunity to encourage, this opportunity to greet one another. I pray, Father, your blessing upon each one that watches just say that your Holy Spirit would just be very real and that you, Lord, as we uh, uh, speak with one another, as we connect with one another, we'll recognize that we're not alone in this, that we are struggling together during this whole season of COVID. And we pray that you would just give us strength and give us encouragement and lift each one up, Father. Help us to be stronger together. Help us to be better together. And I thank you so much for each one that is sharing with us today. And, uh, I pray your blessing on each one. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Hey, thanks so much for watching. Uh, God willing, we'll be back tomorrow to talk a little bit more about some ways that we can connect and uh, how we can be the church and not just go to church. Um, so I trust you have a great day. Whatever you're doing today, may you be blessed and uh, may you be encouraged. Have a great day. See you tomorrow. God bless.